If you're in AP Calculus this fall, taking derivatives can be challenging, but what's even more difficult is not knowing you should be taking the derivative to solve this problem. How you would approach a problem like this is like any typical limit, but when you plug in three, we get an indeterminate form. 27 minus 27 over three minus three. Now, depending on where you're at in your course, some of you have already figured out the answer to this problem, but others of you are probably struggling to figure out what should you do. In this problem, I know that this is the format of the limit definition, f prime of a is equal to the limit as x approaches a. So in this problem, the first thing I would do is understand that this is the limit definition of a derivative. Clearly, f prime of a is equal to the limit as x approaches a of f of x minus f of a over x minus a. So this problem is simply asking us to find f prime of three. And the only way that you're gonna figure that out is if you know all of the definitions of a derivative. So this is a quick fix. Here's what you would do next. We can look at our problem and see that our function is x cubed. And because that's our function, we're gonna be taking the derivative of x cubed and we're simply just gonna plug in the value of three. Now, the derivative of x cubed is gonna be three x squared. And then when we plug in three, we end up getting that our answer is 20. Seven. Now, if you were able to solve this problem quicker, let me know in the comments.